They are cold-blooded kitten killers, and tonight a local man and woman have been sentenced to a punishment unlike any you've ever seen. Hi, everybody, and thank you for joining us tonight. Jail is not enough for the judge who sentenced this pair on animal abuse charges. Fox 8 News reporter Kathleen Cochran live in Russell Township with details. Hi, Bill and Stacy. Well, the couple is accused of throwing two cats like this one here out of their car and killing them. Now, as part of their sentence, this little guy's having fun, but now as part of their sentence, the couple is going to have to come right here. Ooh, and Honey, hi, Will. How are you? Erin Gorski is an adoption counselor at the Giaga Humane Society. She's dedicated her life to helping animals, and a big part of her job is keeping this shelter clean. Now she's about to get some help from two unlikely candidates. This was the first time, I believe, definitely the first time in the four years that I've been here that that has been a part of the sentence. The executive director of the shelter is talking about a judge's decision to sentence a couple to 40 hours of community service right here. Jeremy and Jacqueline Brock are accused of throwing two kittens out of their moving vehicle in Geauga County. The kittens died. Now the couple will spend a week in jail and 40 hours here. There is definitely plenty to do. Anything that you can see needs to be wiped down or scrubbed. And that's not all. They may be shoveling hay in the barn one day or cleaning dog cages the next. And Aaron says this job isn't for the weak. Physically, it's demanding, you know, because we're lifting 50-pound bags of cat litter and dog food and stuff like that. But working here at the shelter isn't just about punishment. It's about education. And the hope is the couple accused of killing two kittens will learn from their mistake. I just want them to look, you know, at these cats and realize, you know, this is what we do with our life. You know, this is what we, you know, these cats are like my own cats. You know, I love these cats to death, you know, and just the thought of them doing that just breaks my heart. Well, there are lots of cats here. All of them are nice, and honestly, you know, it's my luck that something like that would just happen. I'm obviously not a cat person, but the people here do say that they are looking forward to this couple coming in and hope that they can leave here with some type of an education. You know, I'd been holding that cat. Everything had been going well until right when we came on the air, but I'm fine. Maybe just a little uh, scratches. You know, about reporters and animals, and that will end up on a reel for somebody. So. Oh, no kidding. That was like an out-of-body experience. How embarrassing. No, we're glad you're okay. That's all that matters. So I'm Thanks, just Kevin. fine. Thanks. Thanks.